name is Zidiac and welcome to Cruise Line Simulator, a game that has just came out. It's in beta, paid access, but this is meant to be one of the most realistic and most amazing cruise line games in the world. Your boy is going to be sailing the seven seas right now in a huge cruise ship. And if you guys enjoy this, then make sure you smash that like button down below. If you are new in here, then make sure you do subscribe so you're notified that the next episode does come out. But it says right now, welcome to Cruise Line Simulator. Your boy is going to jump straight into this. We have no save games because I've never played this game before in my life. We're going to do a new save file right now. Unnamed, and we've got 20,000 big ones to spend. So I wonder what we can buy. And I wonder what we can do with this game right now. Now, I'm fully aware that this game is in beta. So, gonna be expecting tons of bugs. Gonna be expecting not a lot of stuff to do. But that's what happens when you kind of get access to a game in beta. So, by clicking the grey, you understand that the game is in beta stage. Literally, I've just said this. Meaning there will be bugs and the game will get more content updates. Uh, can I press decline? What happens if you press decline? Does it kick you out the game? <laughs> that would kind of be hilarious, wouldn't it? But I'm here, stuck in the middle of nowhere. We are in Port Can Canaveral. Port Canaveral? Is that how you say it? I don't know. But it says here at the top right now, Welcome to Cruise Line Simulator. I'm Bryce and I'm going to help you get skied. Open up the Manage Ships menu and click the Spawn Ship. Then spawn your ship. Right. Okay. So Manage Ships... Have I been given like a, like a, a basic starter ship? Is that what's happened right now? So here we got the MV, no ship name. Can we give it a name? Uh, ship class, uh, custom navigator class, port of registry, uh, mid Kago. Yo, we can register the ships at different ports. This sounds kind of amazing right now. Please wait as your ship is spawning. Now you need to drive to the dock uh, to do this. Oh, hold on. Right, hold on. Get rid of that. So now we need to drive to the dock. Where is the dock right now? Uh, do, 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 you need to, uh, to do this, uh, open the drive ship. Okay. Perfect. Now pull up to a pier and click on the green button. Right. Is is this a pier? I, I have no idea where I am right now. I feel like my ship is like miles away. Uh, so click on the green dock button. Where's this? Uh, pull up to a pier. Click the green, okay, right. Uh, to do, dock it a pier. Right, Okay. Um, I'm not sure what's gone down. I have no idea where I am right now. I don't even know if I was meant to spawn here. I'll be honest with you. No idea. But, uh, that appears when you're close enough to appear. Now, I'm going to assume this is a pier. But at the same time, right, I have no idea where my ship actually is. Guys, where have they put your boy's ship right now? I don't know. Get rid of you. Manage, no, manage ship. Right, onboard ship. Right, despawn. Right, I'm back here. Spawn. Yeah. I was doing it completely wrong. You have to go to manage ships, then get and press get on board ship. I feel so stupid. But now we're on here. I can now drive the ship, right? Is that how it works? Drive ship. So is there a place for me? You know what? This ship I, I mean I mean I'm in the swimming pool right now. But is there a place that I could sit down? Oh my goodness, we got burgers on the scene? Yo, we did delicious burgers. Delicious burgers right now. So I'm not quite sure how I'm meant to sail the boat or drive the boat or all that kind of jazz. But can I, like, increase speed? Oh, snap. Okay. We're actually... The boat's actually moving. Right, okay. I need to quickly get on the roof or something like that <laughs> on the top of the, the ship so I can actually see how we are now progressing and moving along. So if I turn to the, to, to the port... There we go. So, perfect. Now, I pull up to a pier. I press the green dock button. Are these all the piers right in front of me? I assume that they are. Are we going to um, stop the turn? Yo, this is, like, crazy. This is legit crazy. Do I just try and, like, you know, park here in a way? Right, incre I'm increasing the speed by quite a bit. Start turning here. Maybe decrease the speed. Yikes. This is quite terrifying. Because, if I'm honest with you right now, I feel like this is such a huge ship. And I'm trying to control it, but we all know. Let's be honest with you now, guys. We all know I'm going to low-key crash it. We all know this, right? 
Right, decrease the speed by quite a bit. And stop the turn. And then port thrusters so we go slightly over. Maybe go forward a bit more. Right, is this allowing me to... Um, right, we can stop the propulsion right now. Dock the ship. Right, we don't talk about how dangerous that did get. But we've now officially docked. So, we've done it. We've docked that up here. Oh, no way. It actually gives you... Stairs to walk in. That's actually kind of amazing, isn't it? That is actually low-key kind of amazing. So, we can undock the ship. Right, undocking ship, which actually gets rid of the uh, the actual uh, little staircase to it, which is kind of cool. We can dock it back up again. Right, will it open it up? Yes, it actually does. That is amazing. So we've actually docked this ship right now. I can skip the tutorial because I feel like I pretty much know what I'm doing right now. But there we go. We actually docked it. That's kind of cool. So this we're in uh, mid big cargo is that where the ship was registered yes it was so in reality then we want to kind of go to a new area so if i toggle the map we are currently in oh we're over here so i could go to port carnival right now it's literally sail all the way over there that should be pretty fun to get to wouldn't it i think it would i can manage the islands you can get your own private islands which is kind of crazy the ship store right now is where I can buy better ones. So they give us one for free. 6 million. 15 million. 500 million! What's this one? Oh, this one purchases for free. It's a Game Pass ship. That's kind of crazy. Should I get it? Ooh, let me know in the comment section, guys. Should I get this right now? Hmm, interesting. Right, manage ship anyway. So this is my ship. We have other fleets... Um, I can board somebody else's ship right now, which is kind of crazy. Uh, the item is right there. So this is how you earn money. Right, okay. This is kind of cool. Supplies! We can resupply the boat, making sure that we've got everything on board for our passengers. And obviously we've got our shipyard as well. So, our ships, how do we rename it then? So rename the ship. I think we should call it SS folio please don't hashtag it please don't hashtag right now it's gonna hashtag it yeah it hashtagged it damn you game why does roblox always want to hashtag your boy right now i don't know i don't know we can change the horn we can call him for a tug ship all right this is kind of cool so the item is that do these actually work we can do a round trip from mikago right now for 2.5 million so the sell itinerary right now we'll get 2.4 million if we do this Passengers on board, 77 out of how many? Oh my goodness me. Can we see these passengers? Or are they just like on? Is it one of the things in beta that's not currently available right now? Maybe. Probably. So do we have them points that we need to travel to? Or can we literally just go where we want? Correct. Right, so round trip uh, cruise from Bicargo. So like, what does that mean? I can go places? Destinations remaining. Oh! So, fam, um, Yeah, is that how you pronounce it? So, that's where we got to go next, which is on the opposite side. Right. We best get going then, boys. So, first things first, undock the ship. I'm going to run to the top anyway so I can see what is... Can I sit down here? I can just chill here as we now set sail. So we're going to drive the ship. We're going to decrease the speed, which puts us in reverse. There we go. We're going to do a port turn as well. And as we keep turning out, I don't know how fast this can actually go. We're then going to increase the speed. So if I stop propulsion, increase it. So we go more forward. What's the max speed I can go? You know, it'd be hilarious if there's like, okay, 26. If there's no max speeds and you just can go like a million miles an hour. That would be hilarious, boys. It would be. So we now know the destination that we've got to pretty much sail to to unload the passengers. I just don't know how far it's going to be. So I know it's over it pretty much in this direction, right? So if I stop the turn, toggle the map. Oh, I'm over there. I am going the wrong way. I am 100% going the wrong way. So, 
starborn turn. We've yes, it's over in that direction. Ha ha! I've already made a slight. Why does a dude shooting his horn at me right now? Which is the horn button? Okay, we might need to rethink our horn situation. He's tooting his horn. Is he going to crash into me? He's turning towards me right now. I don't like this. I don't like this. But I've been sailing for like 10 minutes right now. And I've only got this far. It's a long way to go. I think I might just go to Port Carnival right now. I'm going to call it Port Carnival. I don't care. Carnival. Whatever it is. I don't even care right now. Is he on the... Oh, there he is. There he is. Should I do it again? My horn sounds terrible. His horn sounds amazing. It does. But his ship is so much bigger than mine. Can't be. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea what was going on right now, but that was literally terrifying. But while he does what he's got to do, while I keep sailing where I'm going to sail, should we explore the rest of the ship anyway? So we've got a beautiful little swimming port indoors right now, which is kind of cool. These big glass windows, which I really, really like. Out here, they've got the, the rear of it right now. We could add another another level right now. How many levels have we got to this little cruise ship right now? Holy moly. Got the big boy jacuzzis. Got those. We've seen these earlier. These delicious hamburgers. Yes, please, boys. Yes, please. I'll be taking 10 of those. Uh, down to this next floor we go. These are all the little rooms. Ah, yes. All the little bedrooms right now where all our guests currently chill out in. So this is like a staff door. It leads us out to this area at the very front. Nice. Not bad. Not bad. Man. That dude's ship was huge. I can't believe how... I mean, I feel like this ship's big. But that dude's was even bigger. So these are the queue systems. How you get on to the actual ship itself. There's more rooms right now for the guests. Which is pretty sweet. And then this is the rear of the area. Not bad. Not bad. Now, did I notice that this one here had a red on it? Why can we not go into that room? What is the reason? There is a red. I can't enter that room, which is weird. I can enter all of them apart from that one. Hmm. Seems suspicious if you ask me, boys. Does seem a little bit suspicious right now. But... Again, we're sailing for days. I need to get into the and port right now, which I should probably start turning because I don't feel like I'm going in the right direction. Don't even think I'm meant to be going to this one, which I know I'm not. I'm meant to be going for the one after it. Uh, no idea what that dude is, but it feels like forever and a year since I was last at the other place. So we're going to try and turn it and enter to the mouth of it, which is a little bit of a turn this way. Let's get all these turns just right right now as we kind of head in. I think the uh, in the beta this beta version right now, I think the biggest issue that I found straight away is the fact that the islands are so far apart. It takes forever to do anything or go anywhere. But maybe that's why they're paying so much cash for each of the itinerary jobs that you can legit do. You can make some serious money if you've got five hours to kill. <laughs> right, so we keep turning anyway. Keep getting it rocking and rolling as you're now going to be entering in the port. Also, these large names do me heading, mate. They're doing me heading right now. Um, right, everything sort of seems so blurry in the distance, doesn't it? It's going on. It's going on. But we're coming in hot and heavy anyway, boys. We're coming in hot and heavy. And hopefully we don't crash. I don't know if you can actually kind of go through this. You can't really zoom in on the map. But it looks like there's a little bit of water on the end of it. Kind of signals that you can kind of go this way. So we keep turning anyway as we now enter into the port. And, oh, this is where we spawned, isn't it? This is actually where we spawned right now. So, should I decrease the speed? I oh, know I'm not meant to bring the passengers here. I meant to take them on a round trip. But um, I feel like they would like this place. I feel like they would enjoy this place right now. So, do you know what? I'm going to bring them to this place. Why not? I shouldn't have decreased the speed. I should have kept it up a little bit more. Um, get the turning on the go. There we go. So I feel like I've nailed the driving aspect of this, or the sailing aspect. I'm doing pretty good. Doing pretty good right now. And uh, we're going to slowly come up to this place here. We're going to dock the boat. And we're going to let these damn folios get off it right now. So we're coming in hot and heavy. 
We'll do some thrusting to go to the side a bit more. And we'll stop that. We'll turn a little bit. We'll stop the turn. Bring the speed down. Thrust over. There we go. Stop that. Can I dock here? Yeah? Or is this not a, a dockable area? I don't think this is a dockable area, to be honest with you. I feel like it should be. But then again, at the same time, there's nothing there for people to go. <laughs> it's probably because they're not meant to be here, right? It's probably because they're not meant to be here. So uh, we'll keep sailing. And um, see pretty much where we end up. But to be honest with you, I think this is pretty much a dead end. Because if I, I can't zoom into the map, but very, very... Very, very small. It looks like there, there's either a slight little gap to get out of this area. Or we kind of stuck. It's one or the other. Now, this section would be just there. So, we continue to go straight. I feel like I might be stuck here. Which is not great. It definitely isn't great right now. And now it's just got low-key so dark. There's all cargo that we can kind of eventually look at. But if I this was correct, there, there was a little bit of a uh, exit point. So if I start the turn, but I think there might low key, guys. I think there might be like a little bit of a bridge that's going to stop me from getting through right now. Oh, this is bad news. There is an actual bridge. There's nothing I can do to get through. Why is the game got to tease your boy like this? Why are they going to tease your boy like this right now? I feel triggered. Should we see if the boat can go through it? <laughs> it's not going to go through, but you know what? We're going to attempt it anyway. Here we go. And car. Boom. Am I? Am I Jesus? Because that was amazing. That was amazing. What have I just done? I have no idea. I'm so confused. I just gone through a bridge and survived oh no <laughs> oh no but I think on that note guys we kind of need to end it here if you did enjoy this episode if you want to see more of this as we continue to expand and you know find out all the stuff you can do on this and actually make some cash then smash that like button down below if you're on your own here make sure you please subscribe and until next time we'll see you all soon so good Bye.